2022 Swords and Soccer season was a great season. We ended up finishing 11 and 1 after winning our home tournament and the state line tournament. Uh, shout out to all the freshmen, sophomores, and juniors that we played with this year. Can't wait to see you guys next year and have a great season. volleyball season. Um, I've been here all four years and I played volleyball all four years but for some reason this year was just so special to me and it was the girls I played with were some of my best friends, most of my best friends actually. Um, the coaches were just so enjoyable and fun to be with but we won Badger State tournaments so that was definitely one of the highlights. I'm just so thankful for all the girls who made it enjoyable, the practices, the time we put in and all the coaches who invested in us to make it one of my uh, most favorite memories of senior year. basketball season was it was okay psych just kidding it was awesome we won our last three tournaments we were 25 and 5 and it was an awesome group of guys uh, we end our season with a home tournament and for a while um, we've always done it on a Thursday and Friday and then Thursday we woke up and it was like a blizzard so we had to push it to Friday and Saturday so I was a little nervous about you know how we're gonna how we're gonna play because obviously it's my senior year I want to win the tournament um, but the guys, the guys showed up and our team played the best that we've played all year. And we ended up winning, um, which was awesome because it's you know, a moment I've, I've dreamed about you know, for years. And I can't think of a better way to go out um, or a better group of guys to end my high school basketball days with. And I'm always going to look back on it uh, with good memories. So, Fine Arts 2022, we had a blast. And I'm just gonna play a quick solo for you. Never mind. <laughs> On Thursday, we had our Just for Fun activities, which is ping pong, chess, checkers, free throw shoot, and three point shoot. And many of our classmates won medals in those activities. I personally won in the ping pong category, and there were several that won in the chess and checkers as well. Yeah, on Friday, we had a lot of practices at the beginning, but that was the main day for the performances, singing, playing on their instruments, piano solos, vocal solos. Um, we had a choir, 
where we had multiple people come that usually aren't able to go to state line and a lot of that work was put in by Mrs. Albrecht and we did very well on that. We got command performances for that and a few other um, performances and we sang, we got to sing Izzy Worthy at the very end which was a very powerful message and looking back it was a lot of fun and we got to see um, God work. Um, Youth Ride was a really great week. Um, started off, Jordan and Cole and some of the guys were able to make a truck, able to put some lights on it, uh, shoot up fire, which is super cool. And uh, that was a really good start off to uh, Youth Revival. Um, I was doubting my salvation, and Tuesday night I went down the altar and I was very convicted. And after the service was over, I talked to Brian afterwards. That's where I settled my salvation. I was 99% sure, but I wasn't 100% sure, so I wasn't gonna go to, go to hell over 1%. And um, yeah, that, that was the most important night to me, and there was a bunch of people saved this week, and I'm just so glad that God was able to be moving in this chapel, and I was so glad that we were able to have a great week of Youth Revival. Man, Senior Play 2022, I had a great time. We put out a play for our church and our school. So Thursday we did it for the grade school, junior high and high school, and the little kids absolutely loved it. And Friday we did it for anybody in the church who wanted to come. We had almost 400 people here. It was packed, but it was such a blast. Yeah, it really was. And we're so thankful for Brother Borsch, who allowed us to put this on. He kind of directed the whole thing. And we're thankful for him and anybody else that, that helped us throughout the entire process. When we think of our time in Belize, uh, many things come to mind like sun, dust, the ocean, dogs, and glass bottles and I feel like a lot of memories come such as snorkeling and cave tubing and airtime on the back of the bus and the dog on the golf cart and just being able to minister and we're incredibly thankful for just the opportunity to minister in such a hands-on way going out visiting and we're just thankful for all those who made that possible. Thanks for a great school year. Have a good summer. Thank you for a great school year. Have a good summer. Thanks for a great school year. It's been a lot of fun. Have a good summer. We'll see you in the fall. Thanks for a great school year. Have a great summer. Thank you for a good school year. Have a nice summer. Thanks for a great school year. Have a great summer. Thank you for a great four weeks. I hope you have an awesome summer. Thank you for a great school year. Have a great summer. Thank you for a great school year and have a great summer. Thanks for a good school year. Have a great summer. Thanks for a good school year. Have a good summer. Thanks for a great school year. Have a great summer. From the faculty and staff of Hammond Baptist Schools, thank you for a great year. And I believe it was exactly that. It was a great year. It is my prayer that you'll take all the good invested in you throughout the school year and just do the very best you can with it. Remember, you're not going to improve on God's plan. You're going to follow it or you're going to mess it up. That goes for me, that goes for you, that goes for this summer, that goes for 10 years from now. Just do the best you can with what God has given you and follow his plan. Go Swordsman. Have a great summer.